It's what I had to put up with when I fished for Mr. Bobby. Yeah, but it's worth it. I guarantee you. Ain't nobody does fishing no more than I do. Bill might a little bit. Not like me, though. I'm going to fish to the day I die. I just hope when I get in this shape, there's somebody like me to help me get around. Ain't that the truth? He put my legs where they need to be. You see it, Bobby? I hear. I'm here. I'm, I'm finna back in. All right, man. And we're off. We're gonna see if we can find a few white perch out here this evening. Yeah. I believe Bobby could catch a fish out of a mud puddle. Bobby, you got another one? Yeah. What's the count now? You got about. Fifth thing to my three. Bobby's got him a bucket full of white perch he's working on here. No, Bobby, I got the biggest brim of the day. Look at him. Huh. That's what I'm talking about. Oh. That'd be a good one. Oops, that's a pretty nice bluegill there. Did you catch him out in the water? Caught him right out there in the water, in the mouth. With a hook. That same thing I've been missing all them other ones yeah, right out there. Woo! Right out there. That's a good one. Well, I did have the biggest brim of the day. Yeah, you ain't now, though, folks. But my good bug Bobby said that wasn't going to work. He had to... He had to one-up me. He ain't going to get the whole... He ain't going to beat me, boy. Look at that. That's a pretty nice brim for me. We can ever pinpoint them. I might have to reposition. My reel's gonna quit. I'm gonna have to watch you catch it. I wish we was about 10 feet closer. Bob, we got another. Another brand? Yeah. I still think they're a little bit to the right of where you caught that. You way too far left, in my opinion. You know, sometimes I get a little greedy. If I was just a little bit further over there, I could really tear them up. And so I move and mess up the bite. Oh, it's all up to me now. Then. You do it, man. Do it. You know how to catch a shellcracker on all the fish do you? I don't. I don't know. I most time I was fishing for them, I was using crickets. Red worms. Well, as usual, Bobby, I outfished you. Yeah. <laughs> I'll be caught about 30. I've caught about four. Oh, you caught two. Two? <laughs> I tell you what, though, you even had to take me that truck. I know it. The older I get, the colder I get. There's wind blowing. I'm about to freeze to death. Like yeah, I'm ready when you are. I think we need to move, Bobby, that way. I think we need to go straight that way. That way. Alright, we go that way. Ain't nothing we can do but try it and see. Sure do enjoy being on the water though. I enjoy Easter time of year. I guess mostly because I'm reminded of the empty grave. How many we got, Bob? Under a hundred. We probably got. 34. I figure about 34. Well, folks, it's not always about catching the biggest fish in the pond to me. It's more about being able to spend time with your friends and to help folks do things that they really enjoy doing. So always remember, whether you're at work or play, I hope you have a nice day. This is Bill Reddick Outdoors. See y'all.